Oh, it smells like chlorine. This is for the lovers, this is for the friends, this is for the homeboys chilling in the ends. This is for the best time that you'll ever have. If you want the real thing, you gotta take a chance. It's maybe the right time. It's maybe the right time to love. Guys, so check this out. So this is one of the conference rooms here in Clay's apartment. It has such good vibes, seriously guys. Gotta get some work done. It's been a very chill morning, but yeah, we're here now. We're gonna get some work done. So I was gonna plonk myself down here for a bit. I'll give you guys a tour around this place, maybe later on when it's less busy and stuff like that. So, we're gonna quickly grab lunch. Um, I think we're gonna have Subway. On a side note, started reading this book, Chase the Lion by Mark Batterson. I actually went to go visit the church yesterday. It's an amazing atmosphere, seriously. NTC, you guys got something going on over there. So much anointing, man, yeah, it's crazy. But anyway, I just finished reading his other book, actually. The Circle Maker, oh my, I think it blew my mind. But if you guys don't know about Mark Benson, go suss him out, he's really good, I kid you not. But yeah, let's go quickly eat. Oh, okay. There we go. Been a rainy day, but a good old UPS doing that thing. Oh, into this one. Going around. Give you guys a quick rundown. That's what the go is. Oh dang it! So many, so many entries. Yeah, this is the lounge room, chilling area. How sick is it? You got like free IMAX to use over here. Obviously, it doesn't have like Premiere Pro and stuff like that. That baby suit. That's okay. You got the chilling area. Ooh, check it out. So cool. well, that's me, resident. Let's go to the car park. I'm gonna show you guys how fancy this place is. So this is the conference room area. Super nice, so you got one conference room there. Got another one in there, which I'm in actually. You got another office, which is just right behind me. And then seriously, you got like TV, got a downstairs area just there. But anyway, so I got one of these conference rooms. So I was gonna bunk it down in here. Just came back with Harley, we just got our subway. So yeah, just gonna plonk down and eat it, eh? Ta-da! A very productive day. Really appreciated that room downstairs in the other building. If you guys didn't know already, I started getting into creative strategy and digital marketing recently. I didn't even know how I got into that. I just found out that I was good at it. So I was like, hey, why not give it a go? That leads me to my next point, actually. I constantly have these conversations with people all the time whether I'm having coffee with them and stuff like that, consulting. And it's pretty much the question of what is my passion or what do I love doing? And the way that I figured that out for myself on my own personal journey to getting to where I am now is that I literally tried out all the hobbies and pretty much a lot of the stuff on my bucket list that I wanted to do. So one of the coolest ones was, um, yeah, pretty much working in a hardware store. So last year I was working at Masters and then yeah, it, seriously, it just, it just kept going up from there. So I took that off my bucket list now. And yeah, one thing I know for sure that I don't want to work in retail anymore. Working for Masters, I know that I, I don't like working under anyone. I love being my own manager and I love setting my own time. So pretty much for that, that entails me as working for myself pretty much. But yeah, so that's why it's leading me to become a traveling creative strategist and a videographer. Pretty much the two main things I do nowadays is videography, ooh, sorry, is videography and creative strategy. For myself, like traveling and stuff like that, it's fun. Don't get me wrong, as I tell everyone, it's fun. There's its, it has its perks and it doesn't has its perks sometimes, but it's super fun. One thing that I know for sure is that as you go, you'll get it. For myself, simply because I'm always on the go, there's always new things that are getting revealed to me every day. There's new things that I'm learning constantly, whether I'm in a different culture or a different environment. It's crazy. Man, I was talking for so long, I had to change my batteries. That's freaking, that's not usual of me. So I'll leave it at that for now. I'll elaborate on those topics on the next coming vlogs and stuff and we'll get to it and stuff like that because I just wanna share my experience with you guys and how I got to this place and where I am now. It's a very exciting story. It can get very draggy sometimes, but hey, it's a vlog, so I can do whatever I want. But anyway, guys, thanks again for watching. I really do appreciate your time. God bless, never settle, and I'll see you guys soon. High five.